Robin posits compelling questions. How have primal human instincts made racial and gender bias an innate part of ourselves? Implicit bias. Not implicit bias. Implicit bias. Implicit bias. We all know that if you're human, you're biased. Sometimes that bias is explicit. Other times it's implicit or unconscious. We all have it. So it's about how is this affecting our choices socially? How is it affecting our choices in the workplace? And why does that matter? Why should we all care? Humans, we don't have the ability to recognize when we're being biased, even if we can see it in other people. Just like David Rock said, you know, it's like trying to do two math problems in your head at once. We physically can't do it. Bias gets to be a problem is it when it interferes with the way that we interact with society. When our unconscious biases lead us to make snap judgments or assumptions. Implicit bias was really the source of a lot of the isms that we have in this world. Racism, sexism, ageism. Huge consequences, not just in politics, but also in education and in the workplace. It's not easy to change the stereotype. It takes it takes time, it takes a concerted effort from many angles, but it's what needs to happen. Do you want artificial intelligence to reflect society as it is today, with the gender differences and the biases that exist? Or do we want it to reflect an ideal society? A day when we value each other regardless of gender, for the unique contributions that we each bring to the table. That will be the day that I won't have to worry about being liked. I can just be me.